Welcome to the Daily Business and Finance Show. Tesla's CIO departs just days before the highly anticipated Robotaxi event while seeking alpha analysts weigh in on its potential impact. British American Tobacco and Amazon brace for seven consecutive sessions of losses as Bluebird Corp. faces a downgrade over EPA funding concerns. In tech news, Apple CEO Tim Cook and other executives offload stock amidst market fluctuations. Meanwhile, oil tanker stocks experience a surge with the market on edge over possible Israeli retaliation against Iran. AMD sees a rise after Bank of America maintains its buy rating ahead of an AI event that has investors buzzing. Stay tuned after this short ad break to dive deeper into these headlines and more insights from our experts. Tesla is experiencing changes in its leadership team as Chief Information Officer Nagesh Saldi leaves the company just before the Robotaxi event. Saldi, who started at Tesla in 2012 and took on the CIO role in 2018, is one of nine executives departing this year. This occurs alongside declining sales and a recent 10% drop in stock value. British American tobacco shares fell for the seventh straight session, dropping 2.38% to $35.12. Morgan Stanley downgraded the stock over concerns about earnings visibility and weak U.S. cigarette volumes. Despite sector volatility, analysts remain optimistic, highlighting a strong dividend yield and profitability as key strengths. Roth Capital has downgraded Bluebird Corporation from buy to neutral, leading to a 4% drop in shares before the market opened. There are concerns about the Environmental Protection Agency's efficiency in distributing $965 million for clean school buses. Analyst Craig Irwin points to leadership turbulence at Bluebird as a contributing factor. Amazon shares have fallen for the seventh straight session, decreasing by 1.4% to $182.90. Despite these recent losses, the stock has risen nearly 22% this year, surpassing the S&P 500 index's 20% increase. Analysts are optimistic, with most suggesting a buy recommendation. Amazon intends to hire 250,000 U.S. workers for the holiday season. Apple executives, including CEO Tim Cook, sold shares worth millions under a pre-planned trading strategy. Cook sold 223,986 shares for $50.28 million. Other executives also sold significant amounts. These sales were conducted under Rule 10b-5-1 to prevent insider trading. Apple shares dipped 0.5% in pre-market trading Thursday. Oil tanker stocks, like Frontline, are climbing due to escalating geopolitical tensions between Israel and Iran. Tanker companies remain cautious about Middle East risks, which is limiting vessel hires. Earnings for Aframax class ships have surged 249% to almost $58,000 per day. Suez Max and very large crude carriers have also experienced significant gains. Advanced Micro Devices stock rose 3% after B of A Securities kept a buy rating before its AI event. Analysts emphasize AMD's potential to gain CPU market share from Intel and grow in the AI sector, despite competition from NVIDIA and Broadcom. Expectations for AMD's future AI sales are high. Tesla will unveil its Robotaxi prototype, the CyberCab, at a major event on October 10th in California. The company plans to showcase advancements in autonomous driving technology amid growing competition from Waymo and Baidu. Tesla's stock is experiencing volatility as investors anticipate significant announcements. Thanks for tuning into the Daily Business and Finance Show. Stay informed, stay ahead. Join us tomorrow for more insights that drive your success. I'm Montgomery Jones. And I'm Amalia Dupre. Until tomorrow, farewell. This content is sourced from the Seeking Alpha website, so support our podcast by becoming a Seeking Alpha Premium subscriber. See the show notes page for links to sign up. This episode is produced by Classic Studios. This podcast provides information only and should not be construed as financial or business advice. Check out our other podcasts in our network at ClassicStudios.com.